Newport dates for drive through COVID-19 testing have been announced for Allen County. Thanks for joining us. I'm Dirk Rowley. And I'm Tara Brantley. These will be split between two locations on both the north and south sides of the county. Kroger and the Allen County Department of Health will resume drive through COVID-19 testing later this week for two days at Bishop Dwanger High School. Those taking part will self-administer the nasal swabs. Testing will take place Thursday and Friday from 8.30 a.m. until 5.30 p.m. The same hours apply later this month when the testing location will move to the Public Safety Academy on Ivy Tech South Campus at Patriot Crossing. Testing will take place there on May 14th, 15th, 21st, 22nd, 28th, and also the 29th. Some religious leaders and city and county officials are glad a COVID-19 testing site will be set up on Fort Wayne's southeast side. That announcement about the new testing site was made just ahead of their scheduled meeting to discuss the need for a testing facility on the southeast side. Wayne 15's Angelica Robinson joins us now with more. A group of religious leaders along with city and county officials say a COVID-19 testing site is necessary on the southeast side of Fort Wayne. Today they scheduled a meeting to discuss plans for that, but they learned that there were already plans in the works. The group leading the charge is called Faith in Indiana. They were joined by city council members Glenn Hines and Michelle Chambers and other county leaders. The drive-through testing site will be located at the Public Safety Academy on Ivy Tech South Campus. The new site would allow people to get free testing for the novel coronavirus, but those interested would have to register first. Medical professionals would determine if the guidelines were met. This is a partnership with Kroger Company and the Allen County Department of Health. We asked city leaders what they thought about the latest testing site. We also asked the Allen County Health Commissioner, Dr. Deb McMahon, what she thought about concerns over lack of access to testing on the southeast side. It's just a wonderful coincidence that this town hall is taking place today and it got announced today that there will be a testing site southeast. So there's the power of community. But it's also important to remember that I think it's only been in the last two weeks that the testing uh, restrictions have been lifted. Until I think two or three weeks ago, you had to be in the hospital to have any testing. So, you know, I think we're doing what we can to make sure everybody has access to the testing. To learn how to register for testing or when the dates are to be tested, head to our website, wayne.com. Reporting in Fort Wayne, Angelica Robinson, Wayne 15 News. Now